So we'll have to do a little bit of messing around. We'll get that negative on. This is what's left of the positive. Pretty much junk. Get rid of that. Yeah, bye-bye. Didn't have that on my bingo card for today. Seized motor in Camaro. I mean, hey, I guess look at the rest of the car. Maybe I shouldn't be surprised, but I am. Of course. Why wouldn't it break? <sighs> That's the kind of day it's going to be, apparently. Really can't be that much more left to do here. I feel like we're getting pretty... Okay, yeah. There's a lot to do. We've come to the fun part. The Sawzall. The magical tool that makes all bad things go away. Remember how I said the 454 probably wouldn't make its way into the Camaro? It's because a 6 liter LS is instead. Have you ever wondered what happens when a screw goes down your carburetor and your engine's still running? Me neither, so let's find out together. Oh, that's not good. Yeah. Well, there goes a couple thousand dollars. Merry Christmas to me. Some people would try and have you believe that I just sit here and drink beer and work on cars. And they'd be right. Seeing as no one believed me last time. First, second, third, neutral, reverse, park. Every thing is neutral. Socks. And I just realized this car has no cup holders. Where the hell am I supposed to put this coffee? Oh, well, I gotta slide this car out, bring the other one in. More temporary stuff. I think it's gonna work. We're gonna give it a shot. to fire up the wife's Mustang, I can't take it anymore. And just in case it is, we gotta do one last pull. Okay, yeah. Oh, dude, sick. 67 Camaro. You should totally buy it. What's the worst that could happen? Quarter inch Bondo. Replace every panel on the car. Oh my god, what a great investment. The old Super Twins alive. It's not always about the size of your toolbox, it's about the quality tools that you find inside sometimes. For the die cast cars. That's still a couple hundred items. No, he, we're just working him down the line and he's going to go race. <laughs> am, am I not good enough for you, sir? I'm sorry. I just disappoint. Well, it runs and drives, which is kind of cool, but this motor is junk. I'll bet you it doesn't make 200 horsepower, and that was 50 horsepower ago, probably.
this guy brings lowering kit to a whole new level right on the discs. And we're pretty much gonna hit her hard on this car and uh, give her the parts cannon. I've got, again, I've said this before, but I got all brand new seat covers, brand new carpet, brand new dash pad. I've got uh, floor pans to get rid of the uh, Flintstone stuff here. And usually I like to just, you know, dab a little bit of starter fluid, but uh, we'll give her a little flick of 110. Oh my God, It'd be nice if I get in the carb. There we go, yep. Oh, that's going to be a fire. Yep, definitely a fire. Uh, well, if you never see me again, it's because I caught on fire. <laughs>